Yeah, we've never had bees before. Okay. What you do is say like your colony is facing this way. Okay. Your hive. Uh -huh. You're gonna set this on top of there and you're gonna pop this open right here. Okay, so it's just, closed for now? It is. Just slide it up. Okay. And it will open. The girls will come out. Okay. That way they can go ahead and start taking their uh, orientation flights. Okay. And you're saying do that as soon as we get it home? Set it up on top of the box and do that. Now you can go ahead and install it uh -huh. if you want. It is warm enough. I would just prefer that if you're saying wait a few hours, we'll wait a few hours. Yeah, it gives it gives the girls a chance to relax. Okay. And uh, set it on top. Come out a couple hours later. Start your smoke. Put on your suits. Uh huh. You have to look really good when you're doing the bees. Okay. Oh yeah, in case people drive by and see, yeah. right? And you look really cool. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then you take out five frames. Okay. Set them off to the side. Uh huh. Uh, well, take your, you know, you take your. Uh, Hi guys, welcome back from another video live with dearly. Hello everybody. You know what, guys? Kevin, he just finished. Um, what you call this in English? Uh, setting up the nook of installing. The, oh, installing the nook of honeybees, and I'm so excited to check our honeybees. And then I hope guys you join me, okay? But before that, we need this because it's the very first time I'm gonna get too close for guys. I've been close to honeybees before because my grandmother she used to she used to raise a honeybees just for like her personal so that she have her personal honey. Yeah, I'm very used to honeybee, but that was long, long time ago. I remember I think I was like seventh grade or eighth grade. Yeah, that's the last time so now i'm kind of like a little bit nervous that's why i want to use this when my grandmother have a honeybee where was that where'd your grandmother live here in virginia oh in philippines yeah my grandmother lives in the philippines yeah when she have her honey bees guys she don't have any equipment even uh she we don't have but now i kind of a little bit scared because i've got stung of ha type of bees so i'm kind of nervous so I, I we need I need this oh no no this is wrong this is first like this <laughs> just like that. <laughs> it's so easy okay guys let's go check our new babies It's meat, honey. Mm -hmm. You like that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. I hear them. Wow. You want to pick some up? Wait, pick the bee? Yeah. The bee? Yeah. I'm scared a little. Okay, I'm just kidding, honey. It was a joke. <laughs> so what do you think, honey? Hmm? Oh, no so pun intended. <laughs> Get it, honey? Hi. Huh? I want to see inside. No. No? Honey, I just installed this nuke. What you do is you give them space, you give them time, you give them respect, and you let them settle into their home. We don't oh, open okay. the thing up, even though we just installed it 30 minutes ago, yeah. start poking around. Oh, These okay. are animals, <clears throat> okay? They need to be respected. So, uh, it, I guess you were kind of a little bit nervous to come up here with me when I did it, right? Yeah. Okay, hon. When we do, in, do a hive inspection here at the appropriate time, you can be with me and you can look in it then, okay? Yeah, yeah. I, Not trying I, to be mean, honey. I just, honey, I, I want understand. our girls to get settled into their new home here and live long and prosper. Yeah, honey, I understand, okay? Honey. <laughs> Notice we keep calling each other honey. <laughs> what do you think of that, honey? <laughs> Hun. Huh? I and I yeah I get what you. I know. Mean. I mean, I'm not trying but, to lecture you. But. Oh no, I know, I know the why you talk like that because I'm not making any noise or answering you or uh -huh. because I got hypnotized from the bees. I yeah. Was, I was like, mesmer like mesmerized. Yeah, mesmerized. I'm kind of listening what you say. But you're kind of ignoring me like most times. <laughs> because <laughs> I saw the bees and the the, I saw a bee like yellow. Like, what's that? Like, beside their wings, it's like yellow. It's pollen, honey, on the back of their legs. Here, I'm going to get some. Oh, is that? Yeah, you can stay there. You don't have to move. I'm going to show people what you're talking about. 
Yeah, that's what they go out and gather to come bring into the hive to make honey. See that one there in the center of the yeah, that's camera? Yeah, the yellow one. Yeah, that's a pollen. pollen. It's loaded down with pollen. It's been out already collecting pollen from flowers, from maybe Whoa. our fruit trees or maybe some of the wildflowers wow. in the fields. And then they bring it back in. Here's their, uh, they're all familiarizing this themselves with their entrance. All right, okay. Hold on, let me look at this pollen here. Oh yeah, there went where well, there went one inside with a bunch of pollen on it. So guys, watching the video, just so you'll know, about half an hour ago I actually installed this, and we did make a video of this for our other channel, Homesteading Off the Grid. If you want to see that process, but this is the nuke box that the bees came in. There were five frames, and there were some stragglers in the box. I tapped it down and tried to pour them in. Most of them went in, but for the stragglers, I figured I'd just leave them here by the door. The queen. Queen Isabella is her name. She's in the box. So they know where they're supposed to go. And by nightfall, I guess by dark, they'll be in there. And I'll come out, of course, and gather up the box and remove that. So there's no bees maybe tomorrow thinking they're supposed to go back in there. Wow. So. As, you know what, guys? I learned today that, oh, by the way, we have at least 8,000 honeybees. Yeah. 8,000 pieces. 8,000 pieces? Yeah, and then I caught I thought 8,000 pieces of bees? I thought we had 8,000 whole bees, entire bees. <laughs> I'm just picking on you, honey. <laughs> That's how you do it. Like, and also, guys, I learned, to, you know, the lifespan of the queen is three to five years. You remember how many eggs she lays oh, every day once she's bred? I learned this to the, the queen, guys. I feel so, before, before today, I thought the queen that they kind of have like a good life because you know so many people working on her but I but I learned that the queen is the most it's the most pitiful the queen has the most pitiful job every day because what you call this um not the queen the workers yeah the workers uh -huh. the workers guys it's constantly harassing the queen mm -hmm. like Hey, come on! You're you're not working too hard. You know what? Lay more eggs. Yeah, lay more lay eggs. More Her eggs. job is just to lay eggs. Did yeah. you tell them how many eggs a day she lays? Not yet. I'm okay. Get that. You know what, guys? The queen is get harassed constantly with the workers, and you know this is so amazing. You know the queen, guys? They lay eggs up to twelve thousand. Twelve? No, twelve hundred to fifteen hundred no. eggs a day. No, twelve hundred to two thousand eggs oh, a day. Oh, two thousand, yeah, twelve hundred to two thousand eggs a day. Every day for the Every rest day. of her life. Once she's Until bred with, she died. she'll go out on a maiden flight and breed with like a dozen drones. Go back in, and once she starts laying eggs, about three days after that, it's 1,200 to 2,000 eggs a day, every day until she dies. Yeah, and so she can live up to five years. And if she stops, what happens, honey? And then if she's... What, wait, That's what you were just saying. They harass her. Yeah, if she stops... They harass yeah. her. They go, they bump her, yeah, they start they like they harassing like, her and hey, just make her... Lay. I mean, it's... Working too hard. So you hear, it's like, oh, man, I want to yeah. be queen. Oh, look at her. She's the queen bee. You know, you hear... Yeah, people but, have... Queens really lived more like uh, enslaved enslaved people yeah. than actual royalty. It's so it's no lie. Well, it's a. I wouldn't want to be a queen bee after learning yeah. how what they actually yeah, go through. Yeah, we learned that know? from today. Imagine twelve hundred to two thousand eggs a day. Yeah, that's a lot. That's a lot of work. Okay, guys. Um, I hope you learned something about honey raising honeybees. And thank you. That's it for today, guys. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next time for more. Bye-bye.